Okay, so currently just done uh, qualifying here at Rockingham. Probably one of the uh, trickiest sessions you'll have in a while. You know, the rain was uh, chucking it down, making it really difficult uh, for drivers to, to find traction here. Yeah, easily the the most difficult session of, of the season. Um, we've had one wet race at, at Croft, but that was monsoon conditions, you know, so it was important just to build into the session, see what sort of balance we had, feel, feel the grip, and uh, you know, the car is getting a little bit faster each lap as you get some temperature. So, uh, you know, to, to, to qualify fifth keeps us at the sharp end and keeps us in contention for, for tomorrow. So, uh, be nice if it was dry. You know, the car is a bit quicker in the dry than it is in the wet. Uh, but yeah, it's always a lottery this championship, whatever happens. So, uh, yeah, but, but pleased with the performance. Now, there was a red flag in that session which uh, gave a big. A big pause allowed the weather to kind of settle a little bit. Was there kind of more of an immediate Im impact of the car? Did you feel that it was a little bit drier? Because it looked like the rain had kind of gone off a little bit at that point. Uh, the rain came down hard and then stopped, but the, the circuit was flooded in places, you know, especially the last chicane. There's a lot of standing water, so um, I don't think the grip was as good towards the end of the session. There's a few people improved, you know, just I suppose a bit more confidence, but uh, yeah, it's important just to try and survive. Now, I mean, you're probably one of the many drivers who will uh, be happy at this, and it's uh, it's supposed to be dry tomorrow, uh, which gives you a lot of action. Still a good qualifying, of course, uh, P5, but you were uh, right up the front to, to get your nose in for a, for a podium. Yeah, we're in good good shape for tomorrow. If it was dry, you know, the car was really fast in FP2. So, uh, you know, I'm confident with, with the car in the dry, so hopefully tomorrow we can really start eating into that points gap. You know, it's 48 points at the, at the moment, so uh, if we can reduce that uh, tomorrow, that would be a, a good day. And finally, it's a, a track you, you've been uh, pretty handy at recently in recent years, so surely this gives you uh, even more confidence to get some podiums today. Yeah, Rockingham is, is a challenge, you know, very technical circuit and uh, if you're a little bit too greedy in one corner, you, you lose a bit of time in the next. So, uh, yeah, the record is, my record's quite good here. So, um, you know, we'll, we'll see what tomorrow brings, but the Subaru's feeling really good. Okay, thank you very much for your time, Colin. Very good for the rest of tomorrow. Thank you. Thanks.